Hello friends, uh, I'm Parwiz and this is our 15th video in PyQt5 GUI programming with Python 3. In previous video, we have covered the uh, toolbars in PyQt5. This example is from our previous video that we have made a simple toolbar. If you haven't watched the previous video, I highly recommend that watch the previous videos and come back to the 15th video. Uh, today we are going to uh, cover line edit in PyQt5. Okay, now let's get started. Uh, the first thing you need, uh, you should make uh, a new Python file and I call it uh, line edit like this. Okay, now uh, like previous videos, I copy my window code, copy and paste in this section, like this. Okay, uh, now I need some imports in here. Uh, the first one I need is Q uh, widget. Also, I need a Q message box. If you haven't watched message box, I have a complete tutorial on message box. You can watch that. Uh, and also, uh, we need a Q uh, push button and also a Q line edit like this. Okay. Uh, now in this section, mm, the first thing you need you should make your uh, line edit self dot line uh, edit give it like this mm. line edit mm. give itself okay uh, now you can move your line edit uh, because if I run this uh, let me remove this and I run this you can see that we have line edit in here, but I want to bring it in this section. For this, you can simply move your line edit. Self uh, dot line edit dot move and uh, give it the coordinates uh, 100 by 100. Uh, if you run this, you can see that uh, in here just I changed it to 200 it will be good for us. Uh, now if I run this you can see that we have in here. Okay. Now it's too small we want to make resize this uh, line edit. Uh, for this you can uh, write self dot line edit uh, dot resize and uh, I give it 280 by um, 40. 40 will be good. Uh, if I run this, uh, you can see that we have a nice uh, like text box. It is like text box. Uh, time for making Q push button. Uh, self dot button Q push button. Uh, give show text and self like this. Uh, now mm, we should move the button self uh, dot button dot move mm, I give it uh, what it's 200 by 200 uh, this should be 230 by 230 okay let me uh, run this no, not good. Um, 250 and 250. This will be good. Yeah. Mm, just make it 270. Okay. Now we have it's it, it's looking good. Okay. Uh, now this was our. Uh, line edit and push button. Uh, now I want to make a functionality to this button. If a user uh, enter 
a text in here and if he click uh, this show text the text should be pop up in a message box uh, for this first of all you should define a method at the bottom in here uh, diff and call it on click <coughs> now uh, we want to uh, retrieve uh, the we want to take the line edit or the text um, text box uh, text box text and we want to save it in a variable let me show this I make a new variable text value okay and I want to take uh, the text from the line edit self dot uh, line edit dot text okay now we have the text and it's stored in our text value I make a Q message box Q message box dot question the first one is self uh, the second one is give a title I give it I give it line edit and uh, write you have you have typed uh, plus uh, text value like this and uh, I write another in, in here uh, Q message box dot ok and Q message box dot ok uh, now I want to in this section I want to connect uh, this uh, method to our button uh, self dot button dot uh, clicked dot connect and give your uh, method name on click okay uh, now this is the code uh, you can see from this section we have some imports we have a window class uh, I have covered this window class completely by description in the first video. If you like, um, you can watch that video. Uh, but in this video, I just copy this. Uh, this was our line edit. Okay. Uh, now, if I run this, you can see that we have our simple window, and in uh, here, now I want a name. I want to write my name, but with a throw. If I show text, you can see you have typed this. Uh, just you can give uh, a space to this section. Now I write uh, like uh, cute uh, pi cute of five c plus plus. Yeah, you can see pi cute five c plus plus and write subscribe channel and like the video mm. if I show text you can see you have uh, typed subscribe channel and like the video uh, okay thank you guys if you have any question please let me know and also if you like this video or if you love this video please subscribe my channel and also like this video for the further videos